You've probably seen a lot of political ads featuring these two incumbent Republican Senator John Cornyn and Democratic political newcomer MJ Hagar. It's a heated race to keep an eye on. So we asked both candidates the top issues they've been talking about. Courtney Friedman brings us their answers. U.S. Senator John Cornyn has held his position as a U.S. Senator for Texas since 2002. This election, he's campaigning hard against U.S. Air Force veteran and teacher M.J. Hagar. This is the strangest election uh, season that I've ever experienced. That in great part due to COVID-19, which has pushed both candidates to label health care as a priority. Frankly, we had a health care crisis in Texas before the pandemic. And so that's why I'm fighting for a public option for people to have access to that care while also fighting to make sure that we preserve every Texan's right to choose what that access to affordable quality health care means for them. Everyone in Congress believes that we ought to cover pre-existing conditions. Their argument is the only way you could do it is through the Affordable Care Act, and that's not true either. Keeping costs down has proven to be difficult. Both candidates also commented on the most recent controversy, Supreme Court Justice Amy Coney Barrett, who was sworn in last night. I didn't see any reason to delay. Um, there was nothing, there were no rules broken. I know our Democratic colleagues were disappointed, uh, but um, that's the way it goes. I feel like I would have respected this process a lot more if they had just owned it and said, yeah, we didn't really mean that it was an election year, so we can't confirm a nominee. In the end, the candidates did have one same message for the public, get out and vote. Courtney Friedman, KSAT 12 News.